Welcome back. A first in the nation, New York City just approved $15 congestion pricing, bringing higher fees to commuters. But one New Jersey mayor is fighting back, taking the Metropolitan Transportation Authority to court, arguing tolls into Manhattan will increase pollution levels in his state. Mayor of Fort Lee, New Jersey, Mark Sokolich, joins us now. Mayor, it is so good to have you. Thank you for being with us today. Mayor, I'm curious to know a little bit more about Thank you for having me. what your constituents say about this lawsuit and what concerns them about congestion pricing, given that they're in the Garden State and perhaps are commuting into New York City. Sure. You know, Fort Lee and the region, we, we have a big responsibility here. We're host community to the busiest bridge in the world. We have millions of cars that go through our roadways each and every day. We sacrifice a lot here in Fort Lee and the region. Now, as a result of this congestion pricing initiative, we're looking at a traffic volume increase of 20 to 25 percent. We just simply cannot take it anymore from a health perspective, from an infrastructure perspective, and quite frankly, from a quality of life perspective, it's horrible. Mayor, on that note, we have a list of the pricing fees. It ranges from $1.25 to taxis, $15 on cars, which is what has a lot of people really worked up, up to $36 for large trucks. But if it's not pricing, what then would be an appropriate solution? So look, I, I, I don't, I don't, not my job to come up with how they should be raising money. I do know that $24, $25 billion has gone to the MTA over recent years. Not so sure where that money has gone or how they've spent it. I think there should be a full accounting of that. I believe they're projecting a billion dollars from congestion pricing annually. But when you're talking about getting numbers, 23, 24, 25 billion from the federal government, I'm not so sure what 1 billion is going to do, relatively speaking, number one. Number two, I think they got to start to handle their finances in a better way and not look to the commuters and also all of New Jersey to foot their bill. That's simply not fair. I mean, uh, our own governor called it um, just a, a blatant cash grab, and I completely agree. Uh, the other thing, Mr. Mayor, and this is a tangential issue maybe, but, uh, you know, in addition to the cost, this is a regressive tax. It hits people. Everybody pays the same amount, right? So... If you're poor, I mean, when I, if I get a parking ticket, it costs me 50 bucks, I can afford 50 bucks, not a problem. Sometimes I park in a no parking zone, get a ticket and say it's a cost of doing business. For other people, that's a huge deal. Uh, and, and this just adds to that, right? I, I don't know. I feel like this is an unpopular thought, a progressive tax where you, you charge the rich people more. I don't have a problem with that. I can afford that. I hear you. I hear you loud and clear. And when you start adding up these numbers over the course of a week, over a month and over a year, you're talking about thousands and thousands of dollars that are being visited on each commuter. I mean, the prices are during the peak hours, which are 5 a.m. to 9 p.m. during the weekdays. You're looking at surcharges of $15 for passenger vehicles that go over. And there's no relief even with, you know, uh, the for hire vehicles, which are subject to this to the congestion pricing. Also, yeah. it's something that's going to be a life change for a lot of people. They're either not going to be able to work in New York any longer. <coughs> they're going to need to look for employment elsewhere. Mm. It's just not something that they're able to afford, especially those folks that live week to week. And we have our share of them in Fort Lee. Hence the lawsuit. Mayor Sokolich, as we sign off here with you, I just want to note, you know, to your point, you know, former Governor Andrew Cuomo recently wrote an op-ed. As you know, congestion pricing was adopted under his watch back in 2019, and he's now doing an about face. And I'm sure that was something that caught your attention. And I wish we had more to uh, more time to talk with you about that. But for now, Mayor Sokolich from Fort Lee, New Jersey, we're going to have to leave it there. Thank you for joining us.